arrows. They freeze whatever part of the target they hit. Whoever encases their entire target in ice first wins. Keep your eye on number seven from Klausia. He's the favorite. Honestly, Spike, I don't see why you're being so hard on yourself. I let every pony down. Twice! You never let any pony down, so you have no idea what that's like. Are you kidding? I've totally let ponies down. That's not the point. The torch got lit, the aerial relay teams got their medals. No harm, no foul. Can we at least watch from inside there? I'm not sure I'm ready to face crowds in the stands just yet. to thank you personally for saving those ponies and the games, oh great and honorable Spike the Brave and Glorious. You must be very proud. I guess. You guess? I just saw what needed to be done and reacted. It just so happens I can breathe fire, and if any of you could do that, you'd have done the same. Forgive me for being blunt, Spike, but you're not making a lick of sense. Well, it's just how I feel. Wait a second. I think I get it. You keep saying you let every pony down, but we all keep saying you didn't. You know who was disappointed in you, Spike? You. And only you can make it right with you again. What would that take, Spike? Eh, I don't know. Can you turn back time? Because I'd sure like a do-over on that opening ceremony. We can't turn back time, but would you do me the great honor of lighting fireworks in my place at the closing ceremonies tonight? Come on, Spike. You saved the Crystal Empire. Twice. I think you can light some fireworks. Hmm, I guess I have to at least give it a shot. <laughs> 